Hi, I'm Tour Guide Barbie and welcome to the Theme Park Academy. Today's lesson, what we get asked about most, flight of passage. Okay, so what is flight of passage? What is this ride that everyone is losing their minds for? So much so that hundreds of people line up to go into the park before park opening at Animal Kingdom every single day. The specifics of this ride are as follows. You must be 44 inches to ride. Child swap is available. It is disability accessible. You can be pushed in a wheelchair through the queue itself and then you will be transferred to the ride vehicle once you get there. You must be able to sit on the ride vehicle unassisted. And because the vehicles are so specific, certain body types may not fit on the ride. In fact, you can actually be too tall to ride this ride, potentially. It is a simulator, but it's not like a classic jerky around simulator. It's like Soren, if you're familiar with that at Epcot, but like to like the next upteenth level, that's the closest thing to describe it. The one restriction that I do recommend that you heed is if you are afraid of heights, and I mean serious phobia of heights, I would maybe consider skipping this one because you could end up rather high up in the air because you are in tiered seating. Okay, let's go. Parents, right here, we are going into the first uh, one of two video rooms that you go through before you actually get on the ride. I want you to pay attention to this part because this is where little ones start to get a little nervous. Of course, the main objective here is to give you the backstory and why you're actually going to go be linked to an avatar, ride a banshee, blah, 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 blah. So of course they wanna set you up and they make it very dramatic and it's all done really, really well, but it's done a little too well. And little ones who don't know what they're about to experience take this part very seriously. And I've seen quite a few of them start to freak out at this point and then actually opt out of the ride. And if you have waited three hours for this ride, I don't want you to go through that. With permission from the Navi and in partnership with Alpha Centauri Expeditions, we can now bring this amazing experience to you. The way you'll be able to fly is by linking to an avatar that's already on the back of an Ekron. Let's see how this works. Attention drivers, stow your gear on the back wall and then get onto the link chair the way we showed you in the video. Then put on your flight visors.
And that's it. That is Flight of Passage. You don't get the full experience just by watching a video, but hopefully it has helped you understand more about what the ride actually is. You actually feel like you're flying and going through those barrel rolls and you smell the ocean and you feel the wind in your face and you feel the Banshee breathing. It's amazing. Let me know if you've been on Flight of Passage. Tell me another ride that you would like to see. And if you wouldn't mind, give us a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Class dismissed.